another video tutorial here on my channel today I'm going to show you how to make this Rala skirt that attached to your Fiona top and you may wonder where is the Fiona top on my channel <laughs> so actually it's this one I made the tutorial in yellow color so if you go to my main like the my channel page you will see that is the tutorial of this top it's the same design just different color so go ahead make this top first and come back here to continue with the skirt I put the picture around here so that you see how it look on me when I stand up but it's really easy if you already make the top then just grab yarn and go ahead continue this skirt with me in this video but I also want to let you know that at the end of the video I will announce the winner of the Kobo yarn giveaway if you have entered for the yarn giveaway watch out <laughs> maybe you are the winner but for now let's get started into this beautiful Rara skirt I'm so in love with this dress right now I can't take it off I just want to wear it every single day and if you want to know what yarn I use in this project I'll put all the information about yarn use and everything material in the description box below this video so check it out so yeah turn your work in this way and we're going to start the Rara skirt from the side of the body it doesn't matter which side you want to start with just pick one side <laughs> so I'm gonna start from here and yeah when you know where to start just poke the hook onto one of the side of your body of the body of the top and start a round one with chain two and by the way you already see that I work on the right side so that the right side is where you are starting your rara skirt so chain two this chain two just to build up the yarn we are not counting this chain two as the stitch at all not yet and now you're going to add half double crochet across around in this round one so let me make it clear that your round one the total stitch count will be different than mine it really depend on your measurements and also on your um how many stitch you put it in make sure you don't put in so many stitches just like enough and if you just poke the hook into the stitch that already available there you'll be fine so go ahead adding the half double crochet across in your round one now i arrive at the end of the round and i have made a total of 159 half double crochet and you know we are ending the round without any slip stitch and we start our round two right away without any beginning chain so round two you just start with half double crochet in the next stitch you know or the first stitch of your round one and just again this round gonna be even easier just go ahead adding half double crochet in each stitch across make sure you add the stitch marker in your first stitch this way you know where to stop all right go ahead adding half double crochet in each stitch across and you know i'm just gonna show you on the screen how I did all the whole part of the skirt it's quite easy so here in my round two I'm going to finish with 159 half double crochet again and my round three you're just going to increase exactly what it show on the screen and round four round five exactly the info on the screen so after you finish your round five do the repeating of round four and so I just make the length just 12 inches in total and for me repeating round four to get 12 inches is a total of 37 rounds for me so for you if you want to make it longer just keep continue the repeating of round four as many rounds as you want and here how i finish my last round which is round 37 just one stitch before i finish the round i add single crochet and then i slip stitch 
into the next one which is the first stitch of the next round if I'm going to continue but I don't so I just slip stitch chain one and cut the yarn if your top is also have a positive ears you might want to make the strap like my one and the strap is quite easy I have made a hundred chain for the strap and if you want to do 100 chain the strap you need to start with 101 now I'm just gonna make just 15 chain to show you how I do it quite easy go ahead make as many chain as you want and just you know plus one because you're going to start your second uh, row I don't even know that we'll call row but we're just going to slip stitch not make anything fancy just going to slip stitch in the second chain from hook and then you're going to slip stitch in each chain across until the end and that's it that is how you're going to make the strap like my one if you want to grab a written pattern go ahead to my Ravelry and Etsy shop it's very affordable and you will have the pattern download and can look at the pattern alongside with the video tutorial to help you how to make this beautiful rather skirt dress top whatever you want to make in any version you want <laughs> all right and here the winner of the last giveaway please contact me email me to claim your six scans of the Kobo yarn